And new developments tonight, probations, fines, and claims of racism by fans. It's a story we've been telling you about for months here at ABC4. Tonight, the Utah High School Activities Association released its findings involving Tabiona High School and Intermountain Christian School. ABC4's Nick McGurk joining us from the studio with an update. Nick. Well, Emily, this all goes back to two basketball games played by rival schools back in January and February. Now, the decision by the Utah High School Activities Association, it mentions overt racism and harassment of student athletes. I'm honestly disappointed. Tim Dresdom coaches basketball for Intermountain Christian School. They played Tabiona High School in two heated matchups earlier this year. It's an uncomfortable situation for a lot of people. The spotlight of competition Dresdom could handle. But one Tabiona fan, Leon Casper, is found to have said, Go home, Blackie. Blackie, go home. And used the N word to describe Dresdom. As part of the report released by UHSAA today, Tabiona High School and its principal are ordered to request Leon Casper be absent from athletic events for a year. You're asking a racist town to ask a fellow racist to not be racist. It just wasn't enough. According to the report, quote, the panel concludes that there exists among some portion of the Tabiona fan base overt racism and a willingness to accept not only that racism, but untoward harassment of student athletes. People need to be respected and people need to be safe. And that's all we're trying to do. Drizdom, for his part, admits fault. I understand it. After he says he was taunted by an opposing player on Tabiona High School's team, he grabbed the player's hand after the game and said, quote, you're not about that life, which the player heard as a threat to his life. I just thought those things were just totally inappropriate, um, and, and so, I, so I told him. Drisdom is suspended for two games, the association highlighting a hallway confrontation and fining Intermountain Christian School $1,000. That hallway video showing just how heated things had become during one of these matchups. Tabiona High School is mandated to pay a $6,000 fine. They're on probation for three years. And by the way, I just got off the phone with Tabiona head coach Lee Gines. He tells me he doesn't think the board got it right here. He says there isn't a racism problem. There's a coach threatening his players problem. Back to you.